And this morning we are remembering a beloved actor who became an enduring fixture in pop culture. Leonard Nimoy, who starred as the emotionless, pointy-eared Vulcan Mr. Neither. Spock on Star Trek, has I passed away. Like ABC's Chris Connolly with a look back my at his friend. remarkable career and the tributes that are pouring in. Words from William Shatner. I loved him like a brother. We will all miss his humor, his talent, and his capacity to love. The tweets and tributes coming from all around the world, multiple generations of colleagues, ardent fans, and those he inspired on screen and in space, all honoring Leonard Nimoy. I see no reason for answers to be couched in riddles. Star Trek's pointy-eared Vulcan, Mr. Spock, second in command on the Starship Enterprise. Nimoy starred as Spock through three primetime seasons back in the 1960s. In a decade of emotion and upheaval, a compelling figure of pure reason. Most illogical reaction. He'd returned to the character in a series of Star Trek feature films. 1982's The Wrath of Khan would feature a tearful tribute from Shatner's Captain Kirk. Of all the souls I have encountered in my travels, his was the most human. He directed the hugely successful comedy Three Men and a Baby. Good night, sweetheart. He wrote books of poetry, took photographs, even sang fearlessly. <laughs> 2007, he met President Obama, a Spock fan, who recalled on Friday greeting Nimoy with the Vulcan salute and Spock's words, live long and prosper, the same famous words that concluded Nimoy's final tweet. Leonard Nimoy died in Los Angeles on Friday at the age of 83. For Good Morning America, Chris Connolly, ABC News, Los Angeles. So one of the many amazing things about him is he was so multi-talented. Three men and a baby, who knew that he directed that? that? And yes. that great he singing, that. too. And great, well, no, you know, you're being singing. Yeah. reasonably, he sang. I, I would say that, that for he sure. He did sing. He's such a cult following, and it was only on for three seasons. That's also yeah. remarkable. Salute. Can so we good. Salute? As we said earlier, yes, today, today is the uh, first day of meteorological spring, uh, and so for more on that, no. back yes. to... Yeah. He's a, yeah. He thought it was March 1st. You know, our anchors this morning so excited about the weather. Asking so many questions, that's the one you should have double checked. Really. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> by the way, I'm the only loser on this desk. I can't do. I've never you can't do that. No, really? No, it's no. I can't do. Can't do with my right hand, which is weird. <clears throat>